guys welcome back to estella wilson creations today's video is going to be a combination haul i ordered one item from online from amazon and then i got some tj maxx going on and we'll see how far we can get we're gonna start there and we're gonna have a lot of fun today so the very first item i got was really to help um eliminate some of the space that i have and planners i'm not using and being able to reuse some rings the ones that i love so i picked up this pack of 50 rings it says it's made in china but it was a purchase from amazon so my plan is to be able to put some of the planners that i don't really that i'm not using and take the rings off of them and to be able to use the, the rings on those planners on a more regular basis so that is my plan for this i'm basically going to go through my planners not the one with the black rings because i have a lot of planners with black rings but the other rings i want to take those off and be able to use those more often by putting these clear discs on them kind of like as a placeholder another planner ring that i like a lot is the white one so i will be using this throughout the year but i have a ton of planners with black rings on it happy planner can you make more planners with other rings or offer rings of other styles and colors available and more readily available, please? But I did pick this up. I mean, it wasn't that expensive. So I got 50 rings to kind of like play with. I got that. Okay, we're going to jump right in to uh, TJ Maxx. I've found some Harry Potter um, cards. I got two different sets. They were $2.99 a piece, and you can kind of see the design on them. But you guys know, I'm still loving Harry Potter. Let me see if I can open this without... Um, still loving Harry Potter. Look at me. I'm breaking the box. I'm still loving Harry Potter and I love to use cards in crafting. I think they are so good and they're like such a good size. So I did pick this up for $3. I think that's okay. $1.50 would be better, but $3 is okay. But they give you a sample image there and I was like, yep, I can definitely use these. Look at this. Look at this. So if you have a Harry Potter fan... Oh, look at Ravenclaw. I'm a Ravenclaw, of course. And then a whole bunch of sliverings. And the backs of these look like this. So if you have a Harry Potter fan, yes, get these. Get these to play cards with, to craft with, whatever you need, get them. Because they're so good. Um, I do have a Harry Potter advent calendar. If you haven't seen me opening them, any of them, they are linked on the channel. Um, I know we are moving towards the end of the month, so I hope you haven't missed them, but you can catch up um, and see all of the Harry Potter advent items that I opened up. I'm trying not to break this box too, but you know, my luck. So I picked this one up and they had three, but the other one I was like, I, I don't think I would use. So I picked up two of them, but primarily to craft with. And look at the, look at, look at the image on this. I already know I'm going to be in love. So here you can see kind of like our sneak of it. Oh, look at that. Look at the Joker. It's more, that's scary. Goblet of Fire. Look at that. Hermione's wand. Broomstick. Some of these are scary. Like, I don't even know the Monsters book. Um, I'm not a... I mean, I know Harry Potter, but I don't know everything about them. I watched a couple of them. And sometimes, like, a Hogwarts Express ticket. Um, I like this. The Night Bus. Love the Night Bus. I saw that at Universal. Love it. Ron's wand. Harry Potter's glasses. Um, you get to know a lot, a lot more, right? Look at this. It is crazy. Potions. Like, what? I obviously haven't seen this. Maybe, did I see the shrunken hand? I don't know. Some of these are scary. And then, oh, look at this. The bags. You get the castle. Like, what? Okay, so I did pick both of those up, and I think I'm happy with the $3 purchase because I'm in love. Got those. Okay, the other thing I got, which I know you guys are saying, and I don't need any mugs. 
I don't. I really don't need any mugs. But I couldn't help myself. Look at this nutcracker cup. Like what? It is so good. It's a light blue. Now this one was $4.99. And it has this little bow on it, which I don't know. I guess it's a cute bow. I'll keep the little ribbon. I don't know. I got so much ribbon. But look. You don't even want to know because I got a Hobby Lobby haul coming up next and I bought another Nutcracker cup. So I went from no Nutcracker cups to two and they're both really, really cute. So I'm going to leave this one out so I can pull it out when I do the Hobby Lobby one. But I got this from TJ Maxx, $4.99. Great price. Okay, now I have been looking for some bubble bar earrings i'm gonna save the best one for last i have been looking for some bubble bar earrings even my friend tracy was going to get me some from disney world or disneyland and they were like 50 dollars there you know bubble bars are also at target but they were at tj maxx someone shared this and i was like tomorrow or the first drive to tj maxx so my husband spotted this one first um and this one cost 12.99 you can see it has a tj maxx little sticker on there let me see if I can cut this $12.99 sticker off um because I don't want it on my earring okay I got it off but it was $12.99 you guys see at bubble bar Disneyland it was 50 bucks and I was like that's expensive so I ended up getting this one it's so cute and it's delicate it has a bow with the little Mickey heads and I really love this one. Let me know in the comments below. Do you love Bubble Bar? Do you have you bought from them before? And is this a a line that's on your radar? Because if you love Disney and you like really cute things and you want it at an affordable price, Bubble Bar is definitely a line to look out for Disney items. So I got that. And then this one I was even more excited because the one I wanted. Well, the one that my friend Tracy found online, it was $50. It was way more out of, it was just out of my budget. I think $50 for one pair of earrings is a lot. But they had this one, and I would say it's just as cute. Maybe not just as cute, but very cute for $12.99. And I was able to get two still under the price of one at Disneyland. I just think $50 for a pair of earrings is kind of outrageous. Um, so I did pick this one up as well. My husband was like, just get both. So I did, and I'm so happy I did because these are adorable. Okay, the next item I got from TJ Maxx is wrapping paper. I don't need more. I'm gonna start with my least favorite, but I love them all because I purchased them. I got this um, truck. Basically, it has this red truck. It also has kind of like this, I don't know, station wagon. It also has like a bus on here. All of the red truck items that you love with the Christmas trees, the presents. Super cute. Now, this one is premium quality wrapping paper, 76 centimeters, so 30 by 12 inches, 30 square feet. This one costs $3.99, but you get a pretty good amount on there, and I just, I love this print. The only thing that throws me off with this print is the blue sky. I don't really use blue in my lineup, but this was too cute, and I couldn't pass it up, so I'm just going to leave that sitting there. Okay, the next one that I got was this one. And look at all the little bitty cars. Like what? It is so cute. Now this one is how many? 30 square feet? So is it less or more? I don't remember what I said over here. Same. 30 square feet long. So it's the same in the amount you get. And it's premium wrapping paper. So I'm pretty sure it got the grid lines. Um, and this one was $2.99. So this one was cheaper than the blue one. This one was how much? $3.99 and then $2.99. And then I did pick up one more. And this one looks like this. It says Merry Christmas with all the red trucks and the Christmas trees on it. And this one was how many square feet? 30 square feet as well. Now this is a Ray Dunn wrapping paper. So premium. And that one was $3.99. Ray Dunn. Look at that. Do you guys got Radon wrapping paper? Like, I didn't even know it was a thing. Look at that. So I did pick up these 
three wrapping papers. Okay, guys, that is going to be it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Mostly TJ Maxx with a little bit of an online purchase that's going to make my life a whole lot easier. So that's going to be it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're having a great holiday, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.